everyone, welcome to Hot Step Recipe. Today I'm going to show you how to cook Thai dishes. Mostly Thai dishes, difficult and a lot of work to do. But today I'm going to show you how to cook a delicious and simple dish for you. The dish I'm talking about we call Tap Tim Grog. So let's see how to cook it. Okay, first I would like to introduce some of my ingredients for you to know. This one, water chestnut, I use from the can because I couldn't find the fresh one. This one we call red syrup or Thai people call health blue boy. This one, jackfruit, yes of course, it go well with top team crop. If your area have a fresh one, use the fresh one because it would be smell so good. This one palm seeds or we call look jack. All ingredients I show you, you can find them in the Asian store. Okay, open the water chestnut. We use two can, filter them from the liquid. After we fill it, cut it into quarter. After finish cutting, pour red syrup over water chestnut. Mix well and then wrap it. Leave it in the refrigerator and soak it overnight. So now in the morning, we're gonna start cooking the syrup for our top team. Add water, sugar, add pandan. Pandan is the heart of Thai dessert. When you want to cook Thai dessert, don't forget it. Continue stirring until the sugar is melt. Then put the syrup into a bowl, dip it for later. Next, we're gonna cook in coconut milk. Add coconut milk, pendants, sugars, all of the ingredients I told you below this video, you can check it again. And salt. Cook with the low heat. Continue stirring until it simmer on the low heat and then turn the heat off. Next thing, strain water shade nut. Coat them with tapioca flour. While you're decoding water chestnut, you can boil in the water on high heat. After finish coating, we're gonna boil them. Add a little at a time on extreme simmer. Don't add a lot at a time, it will be stick together. When they're done, you're gonna see them folding to the surface. Then take them out and soak in the cool water or water with ice. Do the same thing until all water shed not gone. After finish boil, we're gonna check our top team. This we call top team. See, they look beautiful. So now we're gonna strain them, then soak them in the syrup we already cooked so that they never stick together. When you eat, you don't need to take the syrup with the top team because in coconut milk we have sugar already. It would be too sweet. Now we're gonna filter palm seed. We don't need more any syrup. And also fill chick foods at wells and then slice it. Grease young coconut and then we're done. When you eat it, you have to mix everything together like this. It's sweet, creamy, smells coconut milk, jackfruit, and panda. They work very well together. You can add ice if you want to. Mostly Thai people like to add ice in. It's very, very delicious. I hope you like it and make it yourself at home. 
Thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Check the bell to notification. If you have anything to recommend me, please feel free to make a comment below this video. Thank you so much. See you next time. Bye.